This is the YA and Adult Fairy Loot book box, so let's see what's inside. A little bit of black and pink. I like that. Oh, the darkness within us. So this is the theme card. This is the young adult book. The theme was Decadent Desires. So this is by Trisha Levenseller. Ah, author of The Shadows Between Us. Okay, so this is a really nice front cover. I love the key and the way the flowers run through it. And at the back, <laughs> such a funny tagline. My husband is taking too long to die. Interesting, interesting, very intriguing which is why it should be there. We've got black at the top, black at the bottom. Beautiful, really beautiful. Let's have a closer look. I love the way the, the smoke kind of weaves in between the flowers. I think that's beautiful, really pretty. I love it. So, Chrysantha Stathos has won. By hiding her intelligence and ambition behind the mask of a beautiful, air-headed girl, she has become a wealthy duchess. And once her elderly husband dies, she will have all the freedom and money she's ever wanted. Or so she thought. A man claiming to be her husband's estranged grandson has turned up to steal her inheritance. And to make matters worse, her little sister, Alessandra, is about to become queen. So Chrysantha resolves to upstage Alessandra at her own wedding. And as for this grandson, he may be extremely handsome and mysterious, but he has to go. Oh, and it includes a new chapter exclusive for Fairy Loot readers. Now that is exciting. So first of all, the art. I really like this. First of all, the foil's lovely. I love a bit of foil on the inside, especially with these borders. I've noticed they've been doing it more and more for the Romanticy books. So obviously it started to spread here as well. I really like the art style. I love that kind of bold outline for everything. I think it's really nicely done. And then this is beautiful. So it's a different material, but it's not foil looks really nice and the detail is actually really well done beautiful and then we have a key on the spine oh wow <laughs> fantastic i love that hardcover and then here we have the alternate artwork which is fine it's nice enough it's not it's not as nice as the front cover. I, th I just prefer the simplicity of the front cover. And then on the back as well, beautiful. Again, really nice foil around the, the alt. Fantastic, I'm really intrigued to see what is going to happen. So there's the letter from the author. Oh, she wrote Daughter of the Pirate King. I see. Okay, <laughs> this makes much more sense now. I'm more excited to read this. And then it starts. I love the first sentence. My husband is taking too long to die. <laughs> I really like this book. A fantastic choice. Very excited to read this. So this is the adult book for the month. Again, nice colours there. The the aquamarine oh beautiful okay so the theme is demons and deities the god and the gumiho okay so this is by sophie kim the god and the gumiho i love the fox i'm a massive fan of foxes love foxes and this is beautifully done i really like the artwork 
and the level of detail around here is just beautiful. And then the spine and the back. He's a fallen god, she's a shape-shifting fox. They'll do anything to outsmart each other. Anything except fall in love. Three guesses what they're going to do. <laughs> Beautiful aquamarine colour there. Or turquoise, I don't know. Oh, this is fun. Oh, I really like this. I was expecting maybe a fox, but I do actually really like this pattern. You get all the really nice dots coming in. Mixture of bright and dark, but really vivid colours. It's beautiful. So Kim Hanny. The once terrible gummy hoe known as the Scarlet Fox spends her days working at a cafe and trying not to let a certain customer irk her. Sutka, a trickster god exiled from the heavens, spends his days hunting demons, pining for his lost home and irking a particular gummy hoe. When a demon of darkness escapes the underworld and the Scarlet Fox emerges from hiding before quickly vanishing, Sutka is offered a chance at redemption, kill them both and his sins will be forgiven but Hanny's prepared to do anything to prevent him from bringing her to justice. Anything, that is, except fall in love. So this is the front. I like that. Nice, simple. And you've got little bits of foil as well on the brick, which is, which is quite nice. And the little fox there. Okay. <laughs> Creature Cafe. This is really nice. I love this colour of purple. Really pretty. And then on the back you've got all the flowers. This is the artwork for it. I really like it. I like the artwork of the faces. Very nice. And then let's look at the back. Ah, beautiful. Love blossom trees. And then you've got the foil as well for some of the petals, which looks really nice. So there's the, there's the letter from the author. Okay. I'm really excited to read both of these. I think both these books look gorgeous, both very different to each other, um, definitely very intriguing. <laughs> I love the tagline for this one. Fairy Loot have done very well this month. I love these books and I think they're going to look lovely on my shelf. I'm just going to have to be very careful when I'm reading them because I don't want to do any damage to these. Let me know what you think of these books in the comments below. Have you read any of them? Do let me know what you think of the story if you have. If you want to buy these books, feel free to see the link down below. I have a code which will get you extra money off, but otherwise, have a lovely book reading month, everyone. Bye. Bye.